Ah, good morning, good morning. Exactly here. Well, so you survived Friday the 13th, eh? So you're not superstitious, eh? Huh? <laughs> Walk on the ladders, black cats, kick them, you know, bother about those cats. <laughs> oh, listen here. Did you know that the English people used to have 13 steps on the gallows? Whenever they executed somebody, used to invite everybody to come and see it too. That was great fun. <laughs> Of course, our flag has 13 stripes, you know, our flag. I'm a member here of the United States of America, as well as having come from Transylvania. Zachary's the name here, of course. And we're here for this uh, strange hour of a strip. Well, that's all right. <laughs> Listen, if you happen to be living on the 13th floor or staying alone in a hotel with room number 913, look out. <laughs> I know it was yesterday, but just the same, look out. Some buildings don't even have a 13th floor, you know. Those of you watching in Long Island. Long Island. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I, I love Long Island. I love it. <laughs> Should be aware that Channel 67, when you add it together, you know, 6 and 7, 13. Have you, have you, can you figure that out? <laughs> well, the next hour, we'll visit some old friends here, some of the dear departed, dearly departed, I should say. This is a show that just uh, reeks with bad taste, so we're going to dig into the cemeteries for all the old rock and roll stars who are no longer willing with us. Hey. <laughs> well, let's get going here with the uh, mighty uh, Jay Giles Band and uh, Friday night on uh, Friday the 13th here at U68. <laughs> Well, of course, that was uh, from the old motion picture Fright Night with uh, our friends from Boston there, the uh, Jay Giles Band. <coughs> that Fright Night film, you know, was voted the scariest film of the uh, summer by the readers of USA Today. I don't know, I made a film one time for $6,000, much more frightening than that. <laughs> never finished it, they needed about 100,000 more, eh? but they never got finished. Well, anyway, uh, beware of those apparitions of ghosts tonight, you know, because uh, it's still nighttime, you know. It's, I mess around here, I get back in the... Uh, Got a few hours to go yet. I don't have to get back there yet. I'm found you. Well, we've got a, 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 you know. It's time to water the tombstone, I think. That's the problem. This time. This time oh, I warned you, uh, don't get slimed. <laughs> On the other hand, speaking of slime, I have here one of my, uh, this is a baby of me, but I picked this up on the way over. I'm, I'm in, uh, in Newark, New Jersey right now. I don't know how it happened, but I'm here in Newark, New Jersey. And on the way over here, I stopped by the swamps there where I used to get my great giant amoeba. And the amoeba, of course, is uh, from what we all descended or ascended, depending on how you look upon your neighbor. And uh, they used to get, uh, I used to get the best ones over in the, in the uh, meadowlands, as they call it. Now they kick a pigskin around there and ride horses and all kinds of things. It's kind of squeezing out the old uh, amoeba. So I, I, anyway, it's slimy. So that's, I could digress there, I know, but you know, I'll get around to that later. You've got to learn something here. You just can't amuse yourself all night long watching music videos. You have to learn something from a show like this. Well, before that was a great park course, the Ghostbusters, and before that was the specials with the uh, Ghost Town. And uh, can't you just feel the spirits moving around the night, eh? Hey? <laughs> oh, wait, I want to talk to my wife here. Yes, my dear. Someone asked me earlier if my dear was going to be here. She's uh, in here. <laughs> well, my dear. <laughs> yeah, here, you, you play with the rat, all right? <laughs> Open your mouth. There you go. <laughs> she loves it. She loves it. She loves a little red meat, you know, occasionally. <clears throat> I can't fulfill every need, every need she has, of course, you know, you understand that. Well, <clears throat> she's, 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 I go crazy with these cobwebs! Well, 
Well, what are we up to now? I see. Well, an old friend. Uh, I, uh, I think maybe I'll sing a song. Come with me to. No, I won't sing that song either. Come with me to. Come with me to Transylvania. You'll like it there. You'll look grand in Transylvania. Cobwebs in your hair. Uh, you'll feel at home in Transylvania with Frankenstein and Drac and all those. I forgot the words to my own song. Here's Edgar Witter doing Frankenstein. He'll remember. <laughs> Well, 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 that was uh, Fritz Schneider. He's from the famous Dr. Fritz Schneider family. And the uh, B-52's there with Monster. And before that, of course, Edgar Witter doing his grand update of that grand old version of his of Frankenstein. <laughs> I used to like to uh, play that tune a lot around midnight on the, on the radio. It's always great, great, great old song. I'm uh, going to keep watering the uh, amoeba here and the brain. This is the brain, by the way. This is the brain, in case you're wondering. What, uh, what makes you personally tick, this is it. <laughs> and it's not bad, you know, really. It's a little bad spot here, if you notice that. Uh, we'll get into that later, or maybe we'll just eat that. That's always something nice to do. That's why I like to live in, and, and work in my laboratory, or my laboratory, as they say, because uh, when an experiment doesn't turn out just right, you can always eat it. <laughs> and I'll be putting the brain in here. It's going to be very difficult because you can see the amoeba is just about the same size as the brain. Maybe very difficult, as a matter of fact, but we'll get around to that later. Well, <clears throat> now let's move over to the cemetery. And I'm, I, I, I like cemeteries. I never drive past or walk, actually. Sometimes I walk past the cemetery without... <laughs> Hope you had a good time while you were here. <laughs> I let them give them a big applause. If I have five people in the car, if they don't all applaud when we go past the cemetery, I throw them out. Give those people a hand. I mean, they did the best they could do, and, and here's old, uh, I don't know who this is or was, but we're doing a little thing here now, a little uh, reminder of the king of rock and roll. Well, of course, that was, that was the king, poor Elvis. Blue suede shoes there, yes. I saw the day that Priscilla is now going to write a story of what life was really like with Elvis. I don't care what she says, I bet it was great. <laughs> I bet it was terrific. <laughs> poor guy, well, well, well. He was, he was a great old sport. I remember him well, I remember him well. Oh, my, 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 my. Well, uh, what was I going to do here? I think Alzheimer's is setting in here. I forget what I was going to do. I knew old Dr. Zimer. I knew him well. Al, Al was his first name, and pretty soon they got calling him Alzheimer and became one word, and now they, somebody forgot, you know, and that's what it's all about. You forget what's going on, you got Alzheimer there. Well, uh, oh, there, here. <laughs> I knew there was something here I want to do. I'm watering both of these things here, and uh, I'm, uh, I'm going to cut out this uh, little nasty here. <laughs> it, uh, it'll come out very easily. It's very... <laughs> Someone's joking. I don't think that came from here. <laughs> okay, come on, look. We gotta get... Whoa. That didn't... Uh, <clears throat> that just wasn't supposed to come out like that. I mean, it's supposed to come out in one large hunk, you know. Now here, here, this section here that I just broke off is the section that controls uh, your everyday getting up and going to work, you know, that kind of thing. Right over here, this, right in here, it, it is. That's why if you're lying on that side in the morning, you wake up faster than you do if you're on the other side. Uh, isn't that lovely? <laughs> of course, if you eat a little brain before you go to sleep, You'll never be late. <laughs> what a thought. Hey, my dear. More for you. Pretty good, eh? <laughs> Over the shoulder shot, my dear. Whoops. <laughs> Here you go, my dear. <laughs> I 
If you ever go to Africa, you're going through the jungle and you think you see something sweet and lovely, and you uh, get married right there, then you find you've married a gorilla. You have to treat him a little rough once in a while. That's really what I ended up with here. People ask me what, what she looks like. I've never really shown my dear wife. She, uh, she's not much to look at, unless you're very, very, very fond of gorillas. <laughs> but we have a good time when we get in there. I, I'm going to, I sleep during the day, you see. And uh, when this is all over, I'm not going to wait for sunrise. I'm going to get right in there and get it on with the old girl. Well, <clears throat> we were just speaking about Elvis there and blue suede shoes. But if you look over here, why, it's the guitar great Jimi Hendrix, and we all miss Jimi. Dear old Jimi, dear Jimi, I miss the old boy. Just imagine if he were still around here today, how exciting music would be. Sad thing, sad thing. Well, <clears throat> Who's that, my dear? My dear? Sounds like a wolf. I'm sure it's a wolf. I know wolves. I mean, I've... Well, it's it's uh, it's probably uh, it's probably the full moon. That's what it is. It must be must be a full moon. Well, of course, uh, what does holiday spirit be without the Black Sabbath? Of course, and uh, see the zero of the hero there. Of course, I guess they just uh, didn't care much for nerds. <laughs> I'm not a nerd lover either. No reason for those people to exist. Shouldn't even call them people. Well, before that, of course, Ozzy the Osbourne there with Bark at the Moon. <clears throat> Bark at the Moon. <coughs> I just don't have the, the, any more. Not enough practice. She, uh, ha, <laughs> ha. Takes a lot of my wind out of me, really, tell the truth. <laughs> I have to keep on happy, you know. Well, <clears throat> my dear, we've neglected several uh, other dear departed. Your, your, old, uh, your old flame, uh, Jim Morrison. I, 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 you, this is for her, of course. You don't have to watch if you don't want This is for her. This is Big Jim from the doors, the good old days and nights. <laughs> Sexual healing there. That, that was also for you, my dear. Good old Marvin the Gay there. And of course, before him, Jim Morrison the Doors here at Rock and Roll Cemetery. Well, I promised you had you learned something tonight here. I'm going to uh, operate on the, um, put the brain inside the amoeba here and uh, show you how evolution, uh, how you came to be what you are. You, you could have been this still, you know. But with the brain added, then you've got arms and legs and fingers and all, you can do all kinds of things. This is a baby of me, but I think it's, and they're insensitive to pain. That's one of the good things about them. Absolutely insensitive. They don't, they don't feel a thing, and so you can play with them. And let's see it, it look, look, see, it loves that. It's leaking a little here too, I see. Well, put that back in there. <laughs> so I'll just slice right down here through the outer skin here, and uh, we'll, uh, here we go. <laughs> come on now, come on. <laughs> you didn't have to do. I don't know, maybe. Was that you, my dear? <laughs> she's just playing with me. I know that's what she's doing. We'll just cut it right down here. This, the, this is, oh, this is very interesting. Look here, see, it's already beginning to form a, a kind of, look at that. Oh my. Yeah, that's very exciting. See, there's a whole uh, homogeneous piece there, all one, one large, large hunk. Uh, I, I, uh, that's amazing. Oh, here, look here, here's the, the nervous system is beginning here. 
You can see the nerves are kind of bunched together here. They're uh, all, all tangled up, actually. They're not, uh, not very orderly bunch of nerves. Just see, like, little worms. <laughs> but that's your nervous system. Uh, you, you can't deny these things. This is all stuff you learn in biology in high school, you know. And they're not bad, actually. Nerves are, uh, I remember one night I borrowed Alan Freed's nerves and, and uh, I, I enjoyed them. <laughs> it's very good, good for you. I don't want to make anyone ill out there. I mean, I, I don't... Uh... Oh, oh, look here! Look here, it's very exciting. Look at that. <laughs> this uh, indicates... Whoa! I want to confess to you that I was sick once already this week, and I may repeat that here tonight. <laughs> this, is, uh, this is a female, because this is an egg. Little boy amoebas don't have eggs, don't make eggs. And I uh, might as well have a... Mmm, not bad. Not terribly good, but not bad. <laughs> Where's my tool here? Here we are. What I have to do is cut the... Uh... Well, I don't... This is what, what's going to have to happen here. We're going to have to... Get the brain in the amoeba. Somehow I think uh, this is not going to be one of my better nights. But while I'm watering this thing here... Oh, that's what... Ah, see here? Here, here. I was wrong. That's what that's for. <laughs> see that, that... The whole thing now will come together and uh, I'll eat the egg and the nerves and you'll all throw up and uh, watch the next video. <laughs> While we're walking about here, one learns to fear no evil, even if it's the Grim Reaper. <laughs> well, of course, that was the English uh, metal rockers, the Grim Reaper there doing fear no evil. I fear that this little uh, experiment of mine is uh, not really working out. The, uh, what's that funny old man's name on uh, TV who, uh, Mr. Wizard? No, that's not right. What's his name? Well, he, uh, <laughs> he wouldn't do any better than this than I do. Normally, this would work out just fine. I'm not going to uh, worry about it. Uh, it's, it's, it's too bad that it didn't uh, progress further, but uh, I, see, I see the makings of a great horror movie here based on this experiment, and uh, so I'll save it for when you can uh, pay five bucks to see the movie, you know? <laughs> All right, well, that's basically what it's all about. I'm thinking of starting a new religion anyway, and I'm going to use the Mercedes uh, emblem, uh, you know, the Mercedes-Benz emblem. I don't not gonna mess with a cross or a star or anything like that. And I'll have a, a whole new religion started, and you can send money to me and all those things like you see on TV, and we'll teach you all about evolution and so on and so on. And uh, this is really what uh, we humans uh, started out as, uh, this, this mess here. And... Uh, from what I've seen of the, of the world, uh, we have not progressed very much further than this actually be. We look a little prettier, you know, but basically, this is it. Well, concluding the evening's fun and festivities <laughs> is the story of an unfortunate soul. He drank too much and attempted to drive. However, after his mishap, he awoke in a very unfortunate situation, as we shall see and hear from the local, these are local rockers, folks, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. There you go. I know what we just saw, and it may sound crazy, but I think he's still with us. Uh, to be continued, indeed. <laughs> Real sickos there, I think. Sick, 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 sick. 
<sighs> well, don't forget now, uh, I want to remind you that when I start my religion, I'll let you know where the big Mercedes emblem, emblem all. And Friday the 13th, of course, will be the holiday. Whenever it happens, you're guaranteed a three-day holiday. I mean, that's better than all the other things they've got going and all the other religions. So I'll let you know about that, where to send money. And I, li I like money like all those uh, guys on TV. They're always asking for money. Huh? This one got away from me there. Well, thought you'd get away from me, didn't you? Ha, ha, ha. Hit me, hey! I don't like spiders that bite. Not when we're in my mouth, I mean, otherwise I don't. So. Well, I, uh, this is the end of the whatever it is we've been doing here. <laughs> and uh, after all, it's, it's still only the 13th hour, you can always look at it that way. And uh, I guess it's time for me to uh, party here. And uh, I'm going, my dear, I'm coming home, my dear. She likes me to refer to it as coming home. <laughs> yes, my dear, yes, yes, yes. I'm, I'm, yes, yes, indeed. Wait till I, wait till I, I've got the old, uh, here, and just move over a little, little, either way. Well, okay, all right, all right, I'll, I can do it. There you go, there you go, my dear. All right, now, give me a little room here, my dear. Oh. Yes, we've been on the we've been on the television, my dear. Uh, oh, good old U U sixty eight. Whoa, my dear, U sixty eight. Yes, <laughs> I know you do. You love you love watching the youngsters doing the rocking and rolling. I know, my dear. Now it's time for. Wait a minute, my dear. What's what's? Confound it, my dear. Well. It's been lovely. Don't think you hadn't, it hasn't been lovely because it has every, every bit of it. And uh, perhaps we'll see you later on again. You know, you never know. And uh, this is Zach here saying goodbye. And I uh, hope you have a, a lovely rest of the night. I intend to myself. Here, my dear, flowers for you. <laughs> see you all later. Whatever you are. <laughs> oh,